I believe that you have the potential to find deep peace and contentment, and that that potential exists within everyone through controlling the body, breath, and mind. People can learn to become the happiest, healthiest, and most harmonious versions of themselves through the authentic systems of yoga. And one of those systems that I teach and have fallen in love with is the Ashtanga Yoga method. Ashtanga Yoga can be a mentally and physically intense system, but it shouldn't be mistaken for a workout. It is steeped in tradition and finds its philosophical roots in the Yoga Sutras of Patanjali, which are at least two and a half thousand years old. Patanjali explains that yoga is the stilling of the fluctuations of the mind, and that when this is achieved, the seer abides in their true nature. Or in other words, we find out who we truly are. The nature of the soul is nothing short of utter brilliance. Inside us lies an unfathomable and unbounded source that the enlightened sages have described as truth, consciousness, bliss. The reason why we don't see this straight away is that the soul itself is pure perception. And being perception, it projects itself outwards to see a mind, an intellect, an ego, a body, a job title, a social status, and anything else in the material world it can attach itself to. We're a diamond covered in soot. Our thoughts and identity became so entangled with the world around us that, like the man who cried poor, we forgot the treasure buried in our own backyard, the indestructible ecstasy emanating from within. Yoga teaches us to trace our perceptions way, way, way back to their source through controlling the body, the breath, the mind, and the senses to see clearly that we are an eternal, infinite, loving awareness who is simultaneously one and differentiate from the universe, or what some would call our creator.